Congress, I rise in strong support as a co-author of ACR 113, proclaiming August 15th as India Independence Day. In my city of Artesia, we have a huge Indian population. In fact, there is a neighborhood known as Little India. The area contributes so much to the 58th Assembly District. In Artesia, American and Indian cultures are woven together, creating a colorful tapestry right in my own backyard. So today, in tribute to my many Indian constituents, several of whom travel to be with us today and are here in the gallery, I wanted to say a few words about India Independence Day. Today we commemorate the struggles that the people of India endured in order to gain the ability to govern themselves, to decide their own faith, and to have laws and government that reflect the people of India. The right to have a government of the people, by the people, is the belief that the people of both India in the United States and here in California understand all too well. In the past, the city of Artesia and my district has celebrated Independence Day with cultural programs and dances, kids' corners, boots, Bollywood playback singers from Mumbai. Although Artesia is small in comparison, less than one square mile, to other cities that we represent, its cultural and ethnic diversity contribute in large parts to the uniqueness and the heart of my district. In fact, Little India is also known as the International Cultural District. Artesia is the largest Indian enclave in Southern California, with over 150 shops in the area that cater to Indian customers, and actually to cater to individuals like myself who love to be part of the culture. Artesia has monthly movie nights and has also hosted an international street fair and diversity festival with the community. Performances showcasing cultures from all over the globe and their history and culture, as with the many cultures that have decided to call the state their home, only make California a more vibrant and colorful place to be. All of this reminds us of how truly rich we are here in California. Democracy is a never-ending journey that requires all of us to keep working at it and to keep moving forward. Every celebration of diversity feels like an act of resistance, and it gives me hope. That's why I'm proud to support this measure and celebrate this day with my Indian community, and I'm appreciative of my colleague from San Jose for introducing this resolution. Thank you.